Hi, I'm so excited to be going to Cuba with the Cuba One program and to meet my grandmother for the first time. For me personally, I got to meet my grandmother for the first time and that was really exciting. I had never met her my entire life. I've only heard about her through my dad and my dad himself didn't speak much about Cuba so getting to know her was just like finding this puzzle piece and putting it together and just completing the story in a way that I could never have imagined. And growing up in Miami, I feel like most of my friends had, you know, a Cuban grandmother and I lived vicariously through that. But now I finally had one of my own and I got to talk to her about her life and what she loves about Cuba and what Cuba is to her. One question I asked her personally was why she was still in Cuba because our whole family is in Spain at this point, or the United States. And what she told me was, actually what a lot of Cuban people told me on the trip, is she just really likes her sense of community that she's built in Cuba, and she doesn't want to leave that behind. And, you know, things are tough. You know, one thing she talked about is, for a while, access to food was really tough. And, you know, nowadays it's either really expensive uh, for the average Cuban, America, uh, Cuban citizen to buy, or, it, there's a little bit of it so that was her biggest complaint but again she just kept circling back to community and community and how everyone in her neighborhood is like her family and she wouldn't want to leave them behind. I've, I've been back for a couple days now and at first I thought no nothing's changed I'm still Hispanic you know because I have those two sides two different cultures but there's something interesting, a shift that has happened, you know, whenever there's a Cuba conversation, I almost feel like it's my responsibility to be a part of it. And before, I just tried to stay out of it because I didn't know enough. And now I just feel like I need to give my two cents, tell them, well, I visited the island and this is what I saw. And not that I'm trying to change anyone's mind, but it's important for people to know firsthand what's going on from, from other people's point of view. Hey NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.